Hey, it's Matt from the Green Arcade, back playing some more Farming Simulator 15 here at Selsnovka. Um, we uh, had our, uh, t I want to say tomato, potato planter delivered. And we're going to hook it up here and start planting some fields. There we go. Now, I'm going to fill this up because you can see it's empty on top. And if I can get this big thing over here near the seeds, I think the potatoes are over here too. Maybe. Yeah, it's filling up. Slowly. Boy, that doesn't fill up fast, does it? I think filling the other thing is quicker. Oh, you know what? I wonder if I have to have that cultivated first. Well, we'll find out here in a minute. I can't remember. I haven't done potatoes in a long time. I'm thinking we do. I think we have to have it cultivated. Do we have a cultivator? Mm. Nope. Well, let's go find out. Full now. This just does not look natural. I mean, it, it looks like an airport towing thing pulling us a uh, planner. This is definitely going to become more. This is going to be our only Homer tractor, and uh, it's going to be exclusive to running auger wagon for sugar beets and crop. So let's see. Let's hire that out. Yep, it's got to be cultivated. Oh, we got to have a cultivator. Great. Um, well, we should have bought that horse when it was on sale. I mean, it was only, what, 5% off or something like that, but it would have made it 65000 Um, hmm, how much is that? 69000 That's not bad. Well, we gotta have a cultivator. And I don't like these other ones. There's a small one, but it takes forever. So we we'll get the horse. We got the limkin, but uh, it's it's too big, and it's top heavy. It flips. I've I've rolled a mini a tractor with it. So we're gonna. Just, I like the horse one. We'll get the horse, and uh, let me just drop this here, and uh, let me have that delivered. Not that. Not that. That. Whoops. Uh oh, what I do? I hit a wrong button. Yep. Okay. Let's go pick it up and get this cultivated. Doing some nighttime work here at the farm. We don't do this very often. I will say, I hope that in FS17, Farm Sim 17, that they uh, turn on the dash lights in here. Because, uh, I mean, they need to. It makes it look more realistic. So, I don't know. I need to go back and look at some of the gameplay videos to see if they do or not. If not, you know, when they come out with, what will be the next one? 19? I don't know. They may wait till 20. Anyway, the one after 17, they definitely need to do it. Because, I mean, there's some mods out there. Ooh, we're going to have mod support. I forgot about that. There are some mods support, um, or not support, there's some mods out there that uh, have the cab, you know, the stuff in the cab light up. Uh, but this stuff doesn't light up, and I think that's just a reflection of the moon. Yeah, that's just reflection. So, let's see, let me uh, get a little closer and unfold. This just, it looks crazy. All right, hire that out. I guess I could get another tractor. Um, he's not he's not planting anything right now, so uh oh uh oh, I hit the gas line. That's not good. 
See, it's it. I need to turn my lights on. That's the problem. Out here doing all this work at night. I'm not used to working at night. Like I said, we usually do it during the daytime. But I can show you this real quick. See, I've uh, plowed this up all the way against that fence. So what we'll do is once we get this all plowed up and, you know, straightened out and evened out, we'll just start planting right here and go across this field and plant. Um, and plant this southern section. Um, I could even put a grass strip between there, but I'm not going to. Uh, we'll just plant this southern part of this field and uh, do it crossways. Uh, just like one giant in row and then... Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to leave this planter here. So yeah, that's what we're going to do there. I think I still need to plow over there on the west side of that field too. Up uh, on the northwest side. We'll make some adjustments. But yeah, nothing lights up in here. I mean, it would look so much better if it lit up. I mean, I've, I've got my headlights on, but uh, I know this stuff lights up. Oh, there's a very, very likelihood that I'm going to crash here. Ooh, nope. Just my... Alright, the horn while crossing. Need to cut these trees here. Around the homestead. Get them out of the way. I have decided that cutting these trees up the right way would probably be the easiest thing to do. Just load them with this small front loader. Alright, let's get to planting some potatoes here. Oh, that really changes the texture of the dirt, doesn't it? You know, I think you really technically you're supposed to plow maybe before you plant potatoes to make it look more realistic just turn the uh, allow create fields off and hire the worker out and plow it up uh, we'll skip that this time though maybe we'll do it next time that's gonna be a, a, a requirement in the uh, farm sim 17 though apparently you have to plow like every three harvest cycles or something or planting cycles uh, it's going to require you to plow of course I mean you can turn that off in the settings but uh, if you don't I mean it will require you to plow I mean realistically I mean around here you know they they plow between every harvest uh, but I mean that's real life um, you know it's a little bit different um, and some places don't plow you know between every harvest some of them they uh, some of them just do it, you know, like every every few harvests. So I guess maybe that's their reasoning behind it. But uh, you can turn that off in the settings if you want. But hey, we're going to be harvesting potatoes here soon. Isn't that awesome? I'm excited. It's going to be a slow process, but I'm excited. Alright, while these guys are doing this, I'm going to head back over here and finish selling this silage. It might be a good thing that we're getting it sold uh, because if we hit a great demand and these things were filled to 50% uh, capacity each uh, we would definitely break this map I think. We came close to it over on Bjornholm. We got a lot of equipment over there. Um, And that's, that's why I'm instituting that rule, basically. Um, that we don't fill them to max capacity or even half. One thing I don't like is this curve here. That needs to go. Still think uh, grader blades would be awesome. Or... Uh, 
front end blades, you know, to push dirt and snow with. That's something they need to consider for uh, Farm Sim 17. They need to update the weather. And I know it, it probably won't be for, um, for 17. But, I mean, even the weather over on Minecraft is better than the weather on, uh, on Farm Sim. I mean, it's more realistic. You have actual thunderstorms uh, over on Minecraft. And they're, I mean, they're pretty, you know, convincing. When I'm down there working in the, uh, in the mines or spelunking in a cave, it's pretty loud. I mean, it, and then you come back up to the surface, you get close to the surface, you can see the flashes up the top of the lightning. Um, uh, so yeah, they need to update it. It would just be so cool if, like, you know, you had a, okay, we're going to get radio support on... Farm Sim 17, right? So you'll be able to listen to the radio, like in cab. Uh, and out of cab too, I guess. But, wouldn't it be cool if like, you had a local announcer to say, you know, this week's forecast, you know, partly cloudy today, sunny tomorrow, um, snow on Thursday, and, um, you know, um, blah, 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 you know, expect rain, you know, 30% chance of rain, you know, such and such. And then, you know, the the radio announcer pretty much goes over the forecast. And you can check the forecast still on your PDA, but it, it would be pretty cool if if, uh, if it worked like that. And it might in 17, you don't know. I mean, if we're getting radio support, I mean, I don't... Maybe they're not just going to play just music. They, uh, they could have a, something like that in the works, so... Uh, we're still um, over a month away from it. Um, and we haven't seen everything yet, so. to ramp up uh, silage production again because we're empty here. How do we sit on grain? I haven't even checked that. Alright, we got plenty of wheat. Uh, we're going to do another canola here. Um, we need barley. And uh, we need corn. And eventually we'll get into, you know, sugar beets, and we're working on potatoes now. So. Alright. Guess we could do a barley after the canola, and um, go from there. We're going to get the corn equipment, hopefully. Once we get done selling this, we'll see where we're at. We got a cultivator now, so that's good. I forgot we would need a cultivator for corn. Um, you know what? We're we're into this, you know, several days, and I haven't really seen a great demand other than sugar beets, um, and wood chips. We haven't had a great demand for anything else, have we? No. So we got to hit a great demand tomorrow, maybe. Or, well, I guess it's today now, since it's uh, midnight. We're work. No, we're not working. What's the song? It's by Judas Priest. Living after midnight. We'll just, pre we'll just replace living with working. Working after midnight. It's too bad you can't play that, uh, that kind of music here. Grand Theft Auto for the win, you know, they have a lot of great music over there, and you can play it in-game. You know what, that's a, that's a game we need to get into. We need to do Grand Theft Auto um, for the channel. I have yet to do uh, online multiplayer. I need to get into that. Really don't Still, still working on internet uh, issues, so 
Once we get that, we'll definitely get into the online stuff. Really just dive into it. check on that cultivator because I think I dump this in here it's probably done Let me tab over him real quick yeah he's done I wish their lights would stay on too just a little strip back there but he's still going yeah he's still going uh, we'll just make a counterclockwise circle here. We'll do this field, and uh, I'm not worried about the straw, although I probably should have been, since we need uh, silage. Hmm. Okay. Change of plan. Let me fold this up so I can fit through here without hitting anything. We're gonna go do 14. We're gonna go cultivate 14, unless there's a. Uh, Straw rows on it too. We can bring our chaffing machine over here and pick that up. Ah, there's rows on it too. Let me go get it. Let me go get it real quick and then we'll cultivate after that. Mm -hmm. There you are. I've already got it on there, right? Is that it? Yeah. Cruise control on. So what I'm going to do, just because we need to, to start the silage production, and I don't really want to mow the grass. Um, we need to pick up the straw over here, and it'll probably be you know a couple trips or so, maybe more. And we'll put that in the biogas plant and at least get one bunker up to 25 percent i hate to just you know plow you know cultivate over it i know i did it in what was that field uh, 19 there but i didn't think about it until now so we'll pick that up and put it in the biogas there creepy around here at night. Keep expecting to see the creature from the Black Lagoon rise up out of the water and uh, what was the other one? Um, was it the thing? The old classic monsters that came out of the swamp? Or, well, the first one was a creature from the Black Lagoon. But, oh, 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 this way. Oh, geez. All right, unfold pipe and turn on hydrogen and let it go. I know I need to get more organized on this map. The equipment's just strewn everywhere. We've got equipment way over there and over here, and still got some up at the shop, so we'll get it all organized and uh, come back next episode and uh, have a more organized harvest here. But, uh, we're going to get him to pick up the chaff and. Uh, Take it over to the biogas plant, and uh, when we come back, we'll uh, maybe start our potato harvest here. Uh, need to finish plowing first over on eight, though. And uh, we'll finish selling the silage, and uh, either get into corn or buy a field. So I'm thinking we'll get into corn because we really need to start that. 
So until then, remember you reap what you sow. It's Matt from the Grain Arcade.